when his truck got stolen at the gas station. Nathan Hayes chases it and manages to reclaim it. He chased so hard that one of the ladies, at the time he reclaimed it, told him, you could have gotten hard, it's just a truck, let it go. But Nathan said it's not about the truck. Though he was injured, he crawls back to his truck and sees that his little baby boy in the back is okay. When the police arrived, sheriff's deputies Adam Michelle and Shane Fuller meets Hayes, discovering he's a new deputy, having recently moved to Albany, Georgia. The movie Courageous goes in details about the personal lives of each of these officers. Officer Michelle adores his nine-year-old daughter, Emily, but he's very distant from his 15-year-old son, Dylan, because he doesn't share his son's interest in running 5K. Hayes never knew his biological father, instead treating a neighbor as his father, even giving him Father's Day cards annually, but would risk his life to save his three children. However, his teenage daughter, Jed, resents him because he has a strict policy about dating and he won't let her go out with her love interest, Derek. Fuller is divorced, as were his parents, and has joint custody of his son. David Thompson is young and single. Javier Martinez is an immigrant struggling to provide for his family after being laid off when a construction company went over budget. While job hunting, he walks down an alley, asking God what he wants him to do. When Mitchell saw Javier walking, he thought that's the Javier that he's been waiting for. He calls him over to help with a backyard project and construction. After paying him for the job at the end of the day, Mitchell recommends him to a new full-time job where he is hired. Javier shared the good news with his family. His wife was overjoyed that now the husband has a job and can bring in some income in the house. One day, Emily is killed by a drunk driver, devastating Mitchell and his family. Following Emily's death, Mitchell remembers the good days and the ways he would have been a better father for Emily. He particularly remembers that one day when Emily asked him to dance with her and he declined. He went to the same spot and imagined himself dancing with, her do with his daughter. Following his daughter's death, Mitchell reads about fatherhood in the Bible. He decides he must be a better father and crafts a detailed resolution to honor God in every aspect of his family. Mitchell, Hayes, Fuller, Thompson and Martinez join him in his resolution at a former ceremony conducted by Hayes' neighborhood mentor, the man he thinks of as a father. As a result of the resolution, Mitchell and Fuller mend their relationship with their sons. Hayes with his daughter, and he also visits the grave of his biological father, whom he had never met, and forgives him. Thompson reveals that he fathered a child in college and deserted the mother after she refused to have an abortion. He writes the mother and seeks to mend their relationship and to see his child. After seeing that abandoning kids contributes to crime on the streets and does not want that burden on her, Martinez's manager offers him a promotion on the condition that he falsifies inventory documents. After being given a day to think about it, Martinez refuses, maintaining that it would be wrong. Impressed, his boss promotes him and raises his pay. Also revealed to him that the condition had been a test of Javier's integrity, with Javier being the only individual to pass after many others had been tested. Mitchell discovers that Fuller has been stealing drugs from police evidence to resell on the streets for money. Mitchell decides he must honor his resolution and report the corruption. He sets up a sting leading to Fuller's arrest and imprisonment. 
Fuller explains his motives that he was doing it for his son, feeling that his yearly pay wasn't enough to provide for him. Mitchell visits Fuller in jail where Fuller admits to his mistakes and asks Mitchell to look after his son. During a minor traffic stop, Hayes and Thompson unknowingly confront the armed leader of a gang they have been repeatedly encountering. One of the gang members is Derek, who stops the gang leader from shooting Hayes with a shotgun. After an, in after an intense firefight, Deputy Hayes asks Derek what he's doing with the gang. Derek was the boy who wanted to date Hayes' firstborn daughter, but Hayes did not agree. Now they meet again when Derek is in a gang. And later Derek responds to him that he had no one else that cared about him. At a Father's Day church service, the men present the resolutions and Mitchell argues the fathers in the congregation to be a godly influence on their families. Mitchell runs in a five caress with both his and Fuller's son. Hayes begins to teach and mentor Derek in prison, and Thompson meets his daughter for the first time. Well, that's the movie. Courageous. It's a good movie. Every man should watch that movie.